G-Rex run another one people uh, 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 let's get into the news <laughs> uh we played taily earlier uh we spoke about it earlier this week uh life's good we had our like little tracking radar is that video out yet which one now the taily versus thing yeah it just that, yeah, this yeah, morning. Yeah. More, yeah while, so while we're filming this while we're filming this is uh that video is out uh where we had a meter <laughs> it was pretty much a tie yeah by the time it's out so it was a tie me and friday um like life's good mm -hmm. um Herc and Gucci preferred Killer T's tracks. We had good reasonings, I felt like, for, for both. And even, like, everything that's just been happening between both of the ladies, I love it, fam. These girls got, like, 20K views in, like, a week, two weeks. 25,000 now. That's freaking proper doing better than the man there. Mm, mm. Shout out to the ladies. Yeah, so shout out to the ladies. Uh, before we get into, I guess, somewhat of a round two and everything that else is going on, we spoke about this. Why is there no media coverage from Toronto pages about this? Because I meant mini viral, where Manam took my clip. <laughs> they took the beginning of my Insta stories where I said, Yo, I'm convinced a lot of you Toronto media pages are just out here to like snitch on the mandem and promote like niggas killing other niggas, bro. Y'all don't really care about hip hop or this music shit. I feel like the mandem are encouraging like the fuckery. And they rather just encourage the fuckery. And the next story after that was because they're not promoting the Galdem. Mm. Like, I don't understand why the Galdem are having a musical beef. It, it's rap. Yes, they're getting a little bit personal, but they're out there doing what these guys are doing. And there's no attention. It meets all the requirements for what it would be to get some traction off a post. I don't. We took the bait. <laughs> <What> the fuck? <laughs> it's like, oh, clout. Let's get some. <laughs> I'm just playing. <laughs> He's not though. But yeah, um, I'm, I'm so but, not. <laughs> but yeah, I I don't get why they wouldn't take that time to use that opportunity to be like, yo, why not? Like, why not just just yo capitalize on it? The Galdem are there. Maybe one of them might pick a side and be like, okay, we're gonna rock with this page. I, I'm still confused to like, what's the answer of why they didn't post them, a, a swipe left? Who went harder? Just put the two videos. That would be a dope post. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. <laughs> Can you, like, is there something in the algorithm? Because you're an algorithms guy. Is there something that shows, like, the Galdem don't get more views? They don't get more comments? Like, nope. If you take a girl and make her the thumbnail, especially, like, um, let's say, Tay Lee, with the sexy robe on and, like, a fucking lingerie, I think people are going to click on that. Facts. <laughs> Even I'm just saying. Even Killer T when she was in the back of the car mm -hmm. or in the van, you know, squat out. You know what I'm saying? Yep, sprawl out. Squat out. Yeah, it wasn't the right word, but sprawl out, whatever. Yep. Why wouldn't you guys take advantage of this? Or why wouldn't you just guys promote the Galdem? Like, what's Toronto's friggin' issue with the Galdem? What are these girls doing to you guys where you can't promote them? I think some. I think they're intimidated by the kind of smoke that sometimes women can bring. Like, if they're not happy with, like, if a woman, and I'm not trying to generalize women, but if a woman is not happy sometimes when it comes to these these ladies who rap, they can come down really hard on a nigga. Tell me about it. Yes. <laughs> you know. So, yes. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Maybe, they, maybe they're like, instead of just trying, dealing with the smoke, let's just stay out of that. But it's still... I don't know. I just don't like it because you, you always hear, yo, all these guys do is promote chromas. Not, well, obviously us too. But like in general, all the all anybody does is promote chromas. You have a perfect opportunity to show, no, that's not all we do. Mm. We took advantage of it. Regardless, we were going to rock with them because we, we came out and interviewed them. I took Killer T. I'm, I'm willing to interview Taylee. I'm pretty Facts. sure you are too. Whether, whatever happens, like, yeah. It's not an issue. We're not picking sides, but we're helping the gal them get promo. Like we're just helping them. Yeah, we're getting a little bit clout too. But like it, it's. But they're also alumni, right? That's like part of our mo, right? Like, mm. We had the TNT ladies on the show together. So now that they're separated, that's just still an automatic. Is it really though? Like if a group comes in, because a lot of people don't know our alumni. Little, uh, some I've said it like thirty times alive. How many times you have to tell people thirty times and they still don't freaking figure out certain shit, fam? Okay. For for the alumni that or people that don't know how the alumni system works, if you come on here and you're an alumni, you get free repost on a music video. Yeah. Now, if you're coming as a group and you break up and you put out a solo, you still get that free video, fam. Mm -hmm. Nah, not on six views on cut. <laughs> 
You're not getting a free repost. My bad. Sorry. So got and giving you the automatic. I'm not giving you the audio. You can get it on the We Love Hip Hop, but nah, you got to come in as a solo artist because yeah, well, technically you would because you would have to put out work, so I would have to repost you. But yeah, you just got to put in a little bit of work and come in, do sit down, and let's talk about the breakup, and then yeah, maybe. Yeah, well, <laughs> good thing is we interviewed both of them solo. <laughs> That too. Fuck, I forgot. You got one solo. I got one yeah, solo. So look yeah, look yeah, out for good. that TDG Six Views interview. Mm-hmm. Go check that out. Out right now. Back in the day. She she tells you what um Hood has the biggest waist, man. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Go check out. That's a very, very dope interview. Fam. Classic. 